15 weather. Boy, some of us were just socked in with fog this morning, and there's a good chance we'll do that again early tomorrow morning. That was a view up on Lake Gunnersville as the fog was beginning to lift away from some of the beautiful foliage. The ridges right out there along the water's edge. If you've got pictures that you want to send like this, like Donna Prickett sent to me, you can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter. Love to see those. Love to be able to share them as well. Now, for Halloween night, of course, things are wrapping up. But as we move into the first day of November tomorrow, we're getting up into the 60s and low 70s by mid-afternoon. What you don't see here, a brief period where we get up to around 72, 73 degrees in most communities. But you can see most of the day here spent between about 60 and 70 degrees. Right now on the WVTM 13 Live Doppler, as you might expect on a dry night, there's not a drop of rain to be found around here. A little damp feel to the air, and that will lead to the fog developing overnight into tomorrow morning as well. But you see some showers down to the southwest over Texas, some Gulf moisture pumping up into that, but it's not able to really turn the corner here and get all the way up into Alabama. So as this system moves toward us, it's turning out some clouds, but it will have a really really hard time producing any sort of significant rain. All that's going to be out to the west. In fact, this is seven days worth of projected rainfall. There's just not much to be found around here. Maybe some showers northwest of Birmingham into Coleman, Winston, Marion or Fayette counties, possibly Pickens or Tuscaloosa within the next few days. It's just not all that widespread and certainly not a great chance. Overall, since the 1st of September, we're starting to hurt as far as it goes in the rain bucket in Birmingham. Temperatures in the morning in the low 50s, some patchy dense fog tomorrow afternoon, getting up into the 70s with some sun and some clouds. Here's how we'll do it. You start with the fog. You get a partly sunny sky. There is a low, low chance of a brief sprinkle during the day Tuesday, but most of us not going to see a single drop of rain. Look at this. We get up into the 70s for the next few days for daytime highs. 73 tomorrow, one of the cooler days of the next seven and every single day here is above average. And by the way, Monday of next week, that high of 78. That is very, very close to being record warm weather. We'll, of course, keep an eye out for how long this can last for us as we go into the first and middle part of the month of November. You're watching WVTM 13 News.